In this video, we're going to learn how to report true position in polar coordinates instead of Cartesian coordinates. On this part, I have eight different circles that I want to report true position on. The drawing shows a requirement of 10,000 stay BC, and the basic dimensions are laid out as a bolt circle and basic angle between the features. The problem is right now the coordinates are in X, Y, and Z, which is not ideal for reporting. So to change those, we select all the features using the Shift key, then go to Resources, Features Representation, and where it says Mode, we change from Default to Modify, and click the third option button here. CYL stands for cylindrical coordinates or polar coordinates. Now we open it up and it has a radius, angle, and height. The height represents the distance from the origin or basically the depth into that hole because I have my alignment set up here. Now note about alignments. If your alignment is not set up correctly for polar coordinates, you may see differing results. It's important to have your alignment centered around your bolt circle. Now we're ready to create that true position. We select that circle 6. We'll just do that one for now. And now it has a radius and angle. Now by default in Calypso, it doesn't report the radius and angle or the x, y, z coordinates. So what you have to do is turn that setting on. So we'll go to Resources, Characteristic Settings Editor, and under the Printout section, go to Additional Printout, and make sure that's turned on. Now lastly, we can make it a default to show all circles as polar coordinates going forward. And the trick to that is make sure you have all the features unselected. Just click the white space below here. Then go to Resources, Features Representation. And now we see all the different kinds of features. We just want to change the circle. Go to Modify, click the third option button, and OK. And now any new circle we create will be shown with polar coordinates. All right, if any of you have any questions on polar coordinates, feel free to comment below. And I hope you have a successful day.